wanna talk to me? You wanna be my? All right, let me upload this uh weekly healing read real quick. Girl, I need to get back right. I really do. Ooh, who in there in the other room trying to control the back of my vertebrae? <laughs> All right, <clears throat> let's see if we're gonna get the same message that was out so we can upload this real quick. Real quick, real swift. We got big to the birth in the building. I told you, made your shoulder say. Just don't like it. Mm-hmm. Got big to the birth in the building. Come on, now, man. Oh God, do it. Yes, he will. He's an on time God. Yes, he is. All right, let me stop playing. We're 52 minutes in. 52 seconds. Just let it go. All right, let me upload this real quick. Let's see. All right. Oh, okay. Ooh. Jesus, we got the toad, the family, and we also got the damn pun. Girl, I thought we was off this, though. I thought we was off because we just talked about this in the car. Girl, look at that. Hold on, cut the light up on her. Can you see me? It's a little brighter. But, girl, I thought we was off this. <clears throat> I did. You got toad, family, and you also got the pun. For some of y'all, this ain't nothing but toxic family members. I do feel like that, though. For some of y'all, this is stepping into shit. This is toxic ties. I really do feel like that. Some of y'all got some toxic-ass family members. You got the subconscious. You also have the apple, or you also got the white dress. For some of y'all, be mindful of that, though, because some of y'all, this could be people trying to influence your direction of where it is that you're trying to go. Girl, this is supposed to be a weekly healing read. For some of y'all, this is freedom, for real. Like, subconsciously, uh, <clears throat> we also got milk. For some of y'all, y'all dealing with certain people that's trying to taint this is not a weekly healing read. You got perspective. For some of y'all, y'all got certain people that's trying to taint your innocence. I really do feel like that, though. There are certain individuals who are trying to find a way that they can corrupt you. Because we got solitude. We also got the moon. We also have faith. And we also have the intellect. Some of y'all are dealing with beings who are trying to corrupt you as well. Somebody is coming out this way, but they really this way. Pay attention if you can see. If some of y'all can see, y'all gonna see certain people who like that though, where they shape shifters. It's past like energy that some of them got on them though. Some of y'all gonna start to understand that though for real. But I do feel like with this subconscious and this apple and this white white dress, some of y'all this is becoming more than what it is that you thought you was gonna be. But I do kind of feel like with that pun, I'm telling you that something they trying to taint you, they trying to corrupt you, they trying to push you in a certain direction. So be mindful of that because you also got the tree. Because we got the intellect. This is a whole lot of information as well, though. For some of y'all, y'all could just be tapping into that realm of intellect, though. We got teacup, but we also got the hedgehog. Some of y'all, if you're a creator, please make sure that you're protecting your um, work. However that go, just protect yourself. Because you got certain people who want it. Protect it. Protect it. Protect it. Please protect it. Because I'm telling you, there's certain people who want it. Got the volcano. It's gonna come out. We also got the vision too. We also got the body. It's gonna come out. Because that just took a turn. Going back to it, if you're creative, just make sure that you're protecting your stuff because there are certain people who want what it is that you have, though, for real. For some of y'all, what's going on in your subconscious activity, though, this could be that person where you hear me say, to, uh, doing earlier, where you hear me saying the dream state that's trying to put psychic plants or plant in the dream state to put shit here and put shit there and put shit here to make y'all believe certain things when you actually get up, especially if you don't know the difference between the actual download. And somebody trying to put something in your subconscious to make you think that it's a part of something. So this could be altered memory. Ooh, I don't know what the fuck that is. Just go with it. Now, with this solitude, this moan, this fate in the intellect, I do kind of feel like you know more than somebody. And somebody knows that, though. Because it keeps you free. Whoever this is, though, this could just be the human design, human experience. So let me pull that back. Because this one threw me off right here, though. We got the vision and we also got the body, though. For some of y'all, there, there's leakage. 
Some of y'all could have got y'all body done, or this could have been some type of health issues as well. Somebody could be dealing with something. I don't know if it's poisonous or uh, something poisonous or something that is affecting their womb. It's something about going on with a womb. It's something that could be very toxic, though. For some of y'all, there is a... Um, Something out balance. That's all I know. It's something out balance with the wound. Because we also got this could be an infection. Some of y'all, this could be a staff infection at least. Because we got uh the future, the glove, there's the doctor, then we also got the house, and we also got the line. Somebody got some type of infection. Because we got the spider. And we also got the glove. I told you that's the doctor, and we also got the house. This is somebody making house calls too. Uh, yes. All right, let me pull one more. Because I did not want to jump in the tarot. Which one? Which one I need? Which one I need, baby? Which one I need? Which one I need? We got history and we also got peacock. History repeats itself. We also got the cat. That's some toxic ass energy. For real. We got the cheek. And the eye. Because whatever going on with somebody's womb is affecting their eyesight. So this could be your sacral area, whether you got a penis, vagina, um, a penis, vagina, or a butthole. Some of y'all, it's affecting your eyesight. It's affecting how you look. It's affecting how you move. It's tainted. Some of y'all, there is a tainted vagina. Tainted. Mm, it's tainted. That's all I know. It's tainted. And so this is sex. Why is this coming up though? Like, did y'all not say something as well though? Did y'all not say something? All right, okay, before we get to the reading, let me go ahead and ground this real quick. Uh, before I had said this the other day, I don't know what the fuck that dick is. So let me see. I'll show you where your dick is, though. Girl, they do. I bet they like, girl, stop calling out everything I do. Stop taking shit that's not yours. You got money? You quick to tell me. I got money. I made more money than you. But go buy it. Amazon is sending it to you. What? Right. Gonna be. I got money. I make more money than you. Well, go buy it, dude. All right, let's bring this real quick. Because the other day in the reading, I said that there was somebody who was in a hospital as well. And I said that whoever it was, it was like uh, whoever it is that practiced magic. I said that I had been telling them for like two weeks or three weeks, almost a month, that I said whatever they've been doing with ritualistic practices, I said they need to stop. I said because it's, um, you remember when we talked about that Mayan culture where I said rituals going wrong, how they used to. You know how they do their uh, particular rituals as well. And I said, this particular person, when they was dealing with animals, one of these animals were tainted. And they can understand, like, when it was coming to, like, when they were offering this up to appease a god or coming to form up, it seemed like it was very selfish. So this person, when they offered it up, the animal was being rejected because it was something wrong with the animal. They wasn't supposed to do this. And then, two on the flip side here, where there was someone, because they could have just came in contact with this, though, as well, because this animal may have some type of i don't know some type of disease and then on the flip side here there was another person where i said they were in a hospital and this particular this particular person who was in a hospital they were in a hospital because they had sex with an animal and they didn't want to tell somebody and i said because they had too many people in their room and i said they should have been saying something but they didn't want to say nothing so let's ground this reading real quick i said they didn't and they still ain't said i guess you didn't say nothing though Somebody still didn't say nothing. They didn't. They didn't. So let me pull these out real quick. Daddy may not come when you want him, but he'll be there right on time. I said that though, because we got these. Okay, hold on. Wait a minute. Cause somebody stole something from y'all though. Wait a minute. Cause whoever this is, this could be somebody that could have done something wrong or something bad to me. They could have. 
It's somebody that stole something from you. Probably did something wrong to you, though. My bad. I thought I was coming on. And I was like, all right, okay. Yeah, that's what I said. This is a person that could have stole something from you or done something wrong to you, though, as well, though. Because this is... Because we got... Uh, oh, it went away. I have to find it. Here, we're just going to use these. Whoever says, is this somebody that stole something from you or could have done something to you, though? Somebody thought something that you wasn't using or something that you didn't use for good. Like, somebody didn't see it, though. Like, oh, you, you ain't going to never need this. But it was something that you actually needed. Some of y'all may be, like, collectors of, like, foreign things and foreign objects and shit like that. You may just be into sick shit like that, though, right? N not saying that you're sick, but you may like to collect certain things as well. So you may feel like, well, you like to be the mad scientist going back to the intellect, right? Oh, it's starting to make sense. Because one of y'all, you could be the mad scientist. Not, like, in a bad way, but you could be the person who's the intellect where you like to collect these particular things, right? Hold up, I'm going to show you. You could be that type of person to where you like to collect these particular beings or things, though, and, and and bring them back to life, right? But this could be plaguing someone because whoever's the fixer, they can't fix this. Does that make sense? Because they can't fix whoever this is, they can't fix that. Hold up, y'all. I'm going to show y'all the other card. The reason why I said it is because it came out. But we get it too. Because I said you could be a collector, a person like, oh, I found this. And da -da 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 -da. Yeah, I'm going to take my time. I've been sitting this and I got this in my lab and da -da 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 -da, all this different types of stuff. Yeah, you know, one of y'all like one of them. Nope, wait a minute. Daddy may not come when you want. I seen it, girl. I should have pushed all them bitches back. Bam. This is one of y'all, but somebody got a hold of something that is yours. This is one of y'all. Y'all is her. It's you. One of y'all are a collector. The intellect, the future, and endurance. This is somebody that, um, because some of y'all, whoever this is, they like to pre plan for the future. This could be somebody that could be a lab tech or something as well. Mm -hmm. Some of y'all probably worked for the, you know, the man. And um, somebody could work for the man. Some of y'all probably don't. But this is just something like a hobby that some of y'all have took up before as a form of interest. And I do kind of feel like it's been draining one of y'all down some state of pursuit because somebody have been called for trying to fix this. And you don't know how to fix this as well, though, for real. Some of y'all have been operating, operating, operating. Maybe it's this surgery. Maybe it's this. Maybe it's this. Maybe it's this. Maybe it's this. And it's not. Whoever this is, though, uh, some of y'all have tried shock. Y'all have tried different animals. Y'all have tried different things as well, though. And I'm telling you, I don't know exactly what it is. I don't know because this is a state of information. It's coming in to you, but it's not because it's something about this person. They know. They're not telling you. Like, they know. Because whoever this is, if you could just fix me up just enough. So it works, the surgery or whatever it is, it works just enough. And then this momentum goes out and then boom, now you back at it, right? Because I'm hearing a beep, 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 like whoever this is, you know how to bring them back, whoever this is. I don't know. What's some weird shit y'all got going on over there? Because I said y'all can try a shock. Look at that eel. I thought you can try every goddamn thing possible. Some of y'all are over there working with other animals to try to find this out, though. I don't know. Right? Because this is some shit somebody ain't ever seen in history before. Because some of y'all like, no, if it's this, then why the fuck this isn't working? So for some of y'all, this doesn't literally have to be a actual cure. This could be, this doesn't have to be anything for as medical induced. This could just be a problem that one of y'all got. And y'all just like, well, if it's this, is this, is this, and you're trying to figure it out though as well. Then too, some of y'all, y'all got somebody here that's been, whoever this is, I said this before, we use the energy, the vampire deck. Whoever that is, what some of y'all call y'all power back from this person, they got sick. Whoever this is, because this could be particular people where it's kind of like you energetically breaking off, right? Like, I, I can't explain. Like, if you go watch the episode to where, like, uh, like they feel it. It's not like energetically. It's just like, feel, feel, feel. You know how, like, you, you work in some big warehouse and you just go and shut down the lights. It's the weekend. Everybody's off for the holidays. You just feel, and it's like, the light's going like this with that person. 
Oh, we're finna get off that. But I'm telling you something like that, though. There is a person or something going on. Because some of y'all are dealing with somebody who was stealing your energy. And some of y'all pull your energy back. And now this person is sick. Because somehow, some way, you were keeping them alive. They was not keeping you alive. So this could have been a shift in a power dynamic as well, though, right? And y'all are all over the place. I'm saying this shit is weird. Y'all are all over the place. Because how the hell we just talk about some shit that's going on in the lab? The fuck? All right, but um, some of y'all told you, pull your power back. And when you pull your power back, this person got sick. Or something that's going wrong. I'm telling you, I just keep getting sick. There's something that they're not able to do. Like, you know how, like, you don't pay your light bill? It's something like that energetically or spiritually going on with a person because I keep telling people, unless you like a demigod or like, like the spirit, like the spirit realm or God ordained you to hold this power, humans cannot contain that much power. So their body going into a decay, spiritual narcolepsy. I said that though, a fallen angel can cause more havoc on anybody like anything. Y'all have seen me say this in the videos before. The motherfuckers are apathetic and ruthless. All right. So it's something about that. It's confusing one of y'all though. All right. Come on. All right. That contract up. Damn. Don't keep that with that contract up. Mm. Your soul contract, I really do feel like that is up. For some of y'all with this fallen angel, the spiritual narcolist, who's sleeping on your own gifts, not knowing what it is that you should do, when not knowing what it is that you put power in a certain situation, that is over. This hedonistic, this energy, because I told you, when you're dealing with a fallen angel, these people will wreak havoc on your life and turn around and become into something that is, they can turn around and to become the most person. They'll be like, I don't do drugs no more. I don't do that shit no more. And we're glad to take accountability for the shit that they did. And they will not. This ending has came about for a particular person. But they ain't recognized that though from a more spiritual aspect though. So this could have been somebody that could have been defying the odds. So keep trying to defy the odds. To keep doing the same thing over and over and over again. So some of y'all, this cure that you're looking for. Or to fix a particular situation. It's just somebody that could have been spiritually going a million times over and over and over again to stop. And somebody didn't stop, and it's kind of like, and it's not just like for its root working magically, whatever it is. It's somebody that was told, like, stop. They just didn't stop. I'm telling you for real, this is somebody that kept going, kept going, kept going. We got new beginnings. I told you whoever this is, they, uh, it was a time to. I guess that's it. Yeah, that's it. Girl, give me something. Can I get one card, please? Damn. All right, no, ma'am. Getting back to integrity in a beginner's mind. And on the bottom of the deck, mindful and group think. I told you this got something to do with a group. And look at that. Choices and their consequences. I said that. Choices and their consequences. Surrender. Limitless possibilities. Dream thief. I told you, protect your shit. This is Crown Shocker Games. We got refuse a little call. Some of y'all, I'm telling you, these were downloads. These were messages. Some of y'all were intuitively told that, like, I need to stop. I need to move on. I need to go in a new direction. My life is thrusting me in a different place. And some of y'all didn't. That's exactly what that is. Though. I'm telling you, so somebody getting forced to sit down. I don't know if this for like health wise because this could have been a person that didn't appreciate love, relationships. Um, this could have been somebody that's very uncomfortable with like mm, somebody. Some of y'all date somebody who uncomfortable with love. Then too, this is somebody that's very uncomfortable with somebody not comfortable with themselves being a stranger, but they can't get mad because they make the stranger within themselves. All right, let's see which uh Varden Reed is talking about. Right. With this Garden of Venus, we got Ten of Pentacles, we got the Stock Card, the Ten of Wands, the Six of Pentacles, 
fountain of wisdom, and then we also got two of pentacles. For some of y'all, when it comes down to love, a relationship, this got something to do with enjoyment, though. I tell you, this is that release of energy. Some of y'all don't know how to release certain things. This is a person that will be the dead horse over and over and over again. This is what I was taught. This is what I know. This is what I'm supposed to do as well, though. Some of y'all, when it comes to your relationship with the most high or just religious aspects, though, or however you get down or whatever you practice and believe in, this is what, like, oh, I'm going to do this because this is what I've taught. Like, this is my job. Whoever this is, they lost their way. Somebody lost their way because they look at this as like, this is my job. So there's a problem, though. It's kind of like, yeah, it's, it's not in that state because we got six of pentacles. This is grace. Absolves the guilty. Uh, fountain and wisdom. Yeah, that's why I said. This got something to do with whoever this person is. Where I keep saying this. They look at their relationship with the most high. They stay up when it comes to religious aspects or your belief system, whatever you believe in, they look at this like, this is a job for me. This is not a job. This is a person where you hear me say they kept continuously keep doing the same thing over and over and over. It gives me stagnant energy. For some of y'all, this could have been for showmanship for other people. For some of y'all, this could have been in a state of to where um, it's more showmanship than anything, though, because with that world card and that star card, you definitely begin downloads and you begin intuitive nudges like, okay, let me stop. I need to get this shit up. Like, this could be subconsciously, like, going to the mind frame to where it wakes up in the forefront and you're feeling a certain way because these emotions that you are feeling, they are not new to you. They've been here before. But some of y'all, this is the state of, this could be a relationship for some of y'all, though, because some of y'all going through shit because of your relationships that you have with people and who you energetically or emotionally connected to. Right? Because we got the Nine of Pentacles, and then we also got the Two of Swords. For some of y'all, this could have been somebody who you was in a relationship, and they betrayed you. Because it said, identify as traitors and destroy their, destroy their plans. This is somebody, like, for real, this could have been a relationship as well, or some type of connection, or some type of emotional support. There was someone that was trying to hold you back. I told you, this could have been somebody that could have been an enemy, but they really was, they was posed and disguised as a friend or a lover. This is a person here. Like, they keep up the same shit. They play both sides. This is somebody that brought a whole lot of problems into your life. They only care about winning. This is somebody that only cares about freeing themselves. So now look at them. They stuck. They in this shit. Because they want independence, but now they're confused about it. This is somebody that's going to go right back to the same shit. So don't worry about it. If somebody fucked you over, they going right back to the same shit that they tried to cast for you. Because they don't want to stop. <laughs> we got Ace of Swords. <laughs> mm -hmm. we got six of swords too yep that's a false perception of unity i told you though this is healing the sick i told you that there's something i told you it's a false doctor <laughs> it's somebody here i'm telling you this ain't the person where you hear me say this it's somebody that sat back and watched this intellect they watch this person here and they know they can fix and they know they can do this and they went off and they tried to do this on their own and this is the person that is sick or caught up into something. For some of y'all with this intellect, some of y'all become to trying to get all this different state of information as well, whether you siphoning from other people, using them to the point where you got holes in your aura and you got certain attachments that don't want to let you go. Whoever this is, for real, that's one of y'all A's. That's somebody there, though, because somebody been charging up off somebody. For real, they been trying to charge up off people. And whoever this is, though, baby, is playing with your mind. Yep, we got eight of wands. This could have been somebody that's trying to do telepathic communication with you as well. Trying to make shit happen rapidly for you, though. For some of y'all, this is somebody in position that abused their power. For real. This could have been like, oh, well, no, give me that, give me that. You constantly say, no, the, 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 I'm telling you whoever this is, one of y'all are saying like, no, it's not done. It's not finished. It's not finished, especially with the political aspects. One of y'all saying, no, it's not done. I'm not finished with it yet. And I'm not doing this. Give me the goddamn shit. And so that is how somebody got caught up. 
All right, now with this moon, man, let's see what's going on. Because a lot of that ain't hitting up on the surface no more. This is shit where it say, look at the piss and the light is shining bright, baby. This moon so goddamn bright, baby, look like the sun. This truth, everything that was hitting up on the forefront, baby, this is everything that's coming up to the forefront, though. This is change. This is creating a whole lot of conflict. This is causing a whole bunch of disagreements. Even bringing out competition to certain people, though, as well. Because some of y'all want to get up under the wall and you want to go deep in your... It's, 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 you, you're trying to go deep in your emotions, but you really can't go deep in your emotions though for real because even the water transmission you can't run from this maybe a little murky because the clothes she got on baby you can't run from this and then too this is the clothes i'm telling you whoever this is one y'all got a, a spirit following you and there's a particular spirit where i feel like it's a slave or a particular entity where um it's an entity that's following one of y'all but her clothes it's not like this they look a little dirty like this like they cream they could have been cream or all white but they're dirty like does that make sense like they've been in the dirt bird alive never mind let's get back on subject yeah this new beginnings it ain't so new for some of y'all because some of y'all ain't gonna like it i say that's that person who's gonna go backwards we got the three of wands i told you some of y'all this is protection work this a lot of revealing that's coming up as well, though, because y'all enemies will be exposed. Is it like some Pisces transit going on? God damn. Like, what? I'm telling you, like, it's just for me, the only, when I know that, like, when these heavy Pisces transits come up, they expose all my enemies. And keep in mind, I got a moon in Pisces. And a rat. Damn. Like, for real. You got, like, a Pisces friend that's telling you that? Because they'll do it. You know somebody that's a Pisces, that they'll tell you who your enemies is. They will. Shit, they'll be your enemy. You won't even know it, but they'll tell you who the fuck your enemy is. It was getting in the way of that shit. All right. Um, we got the same card out. We got Ten of Pentacles. This is disasters. I told you that it's being exposed, though. For some of y'all, this is somebody that's trying to put you in a certain situation, though, as well. This is somebody that could be spiritually attack you as well. There's somebody that's constantly trying to experience it, attack you, and especially when it comes to something towards your home, though, for real. Right? This could be somebody where you have to say, this could, I keep saying that some of y'all, if you spiritual, you going up against somebody who's religious who sit up here and play with magic, and they saying that they don't, because whatever they conjuring up, this is some dark shit. Put whichever one on the side. Then we also got the Six of Swords coming back again. I tell you, this is stressed. I tell you, there is a particular person who is sick and stressed out for real. This could have been somebody that you could work with or work with or working on something as well. Some of y'all allowed this person into your home and you're trying to find out something as well. So what's going on? So what you going on? What's going on? Because we got five of cups. I'm telling you, this person mad. Whoever this is, this is a suck-ass person. They mad because whatever they tried to plan for you, this shit ain't working. I'm telling you, this is somebody that's trying to keep somebody stuck. Oh, I wish y'all would have got that um, yes, and then they're trying to come back. Loyalty and allegiances, friendships and reconciliation. What? What? Like, I'm saying, this is crazy, y'all. This is somebody that fucked you over and trying to come and be your friend. Like, they could have left you in a whole bunch of hardships. This somebody left you by yourself. They wouldn't check on you if you was fucking depressed. Wouldn't even give a damn. For real. And then now they're trying to come back because, oh my God, <laughs> but you wouldn't even care about me. I don't know how y'all going to feel about that, though, as well, because with the Six of Swords and this Five of Cups, right? Somebody trying to figure out where did we go wrong. No, don't think about where did we go wrong now. You on your deathbed, baby. I don't know how y'all going to feel about this. Because we got provides expansion, intelligence, and also get a grace of God. For some of y'all, though, this could be a relationship, though. Be mindful if you don't want to be cool with this person. You would be just a sick-ass individual if you constantly trying to take money from them and buy their fucking friendship as well. So you just slow down as them, sitting up talking about everything that it is, and you know this person trying to do everything they can to get back in your good grace, and you taking their fucking money, and you know you don't want to be cool with them. You just as trash as them, and you're going to take their karma just like them. So be mindful of that, though, too, because it's somebody that's coming back to you genuinely. They are. And some of y'all at this point, because you still in the Five of Cups about the shit that they did to you, you're trying to manipulate that state of an experience. And I'm telling you, you're going to be back in that, though, for real. Because whoever this is, baby, they ain't healed right. Whatever they got going on in the hospital or whatever they're healing from, they ain't right. Because the Wheel of Fortune and the Eight of Swords came out in reverse. And these two motherfuckers, I told you, they stuck. 
whoever it is, that's that bad times. And I told you for real, this some seeds that they disown whoever this person is. So I'm telling you, this is an enemy, one that will try to steal your fortune. Then you got somebody else that, um, this got something to do with your Akashic records as well, though. For some of y'all, this is shit that they have done on Earth. For real, I'm telling you something about a lot of things that somebody has done on Earth that's coming back to bite them in their ass, though, for real. So this is spiritual justice as well, though. For some of y'all, this is like, um... You see how this man snatched his head off his body? This is delivering that to somebody. For real. It's weird because somebody bringing you the head of a person. A head of a situation. I don't mean it's like the literal head. But this is somebody that's bringing you the person where they kind of like, hmm, this motherfucker to be causing all the shit, hmm. Like they literally, I don't know if it's in a dream state as well. I'm going to pull one more card so we get to this last card and we get the fuck out. I don't know if it's a dream state as well, but somebody literally bringing you the head of the person like this. Damn, they was the one that was causing the shit. Yep, it's that evil eye. We got to give answers to those in doubt and drive away that evil spirit. I told you that somebody could have been spying on you as well, keeping up a whole lot of shit, trying to keep you binded and tethered up, uh, twined up, your relationship, keep you fucked off, keep you back, keep you from doing shit, keeping you depressed, trying to stop your money, stop you from where you're going. Motherfucker been keeping tabs, your left and right, and this person here, I'm telling you, like, their intentions are literally evil. They were evil. But I'm telling you, crazy as hell if you sit up here. And you, you, you crazy as hell if you allow this person to come back into your life and you just looking at, well, they did this to me, so I'm going to go ahead and get this money off them. You just as fucked up as them and you're going to be in the same situation. Because whoever this is, they ain't here with went on damn bottom. That's all I'm going to say. Because we got five of pentacles, we got the chariot card, and then we also got the fool card. This five of pentacles says patience. It reveals all secrets and spread knowledge. I told you, though. Then we also got the chariot, perseverance, success in conflict, overcoming adversary. Then you got the fool, assist with new beginnings. Assist with difficult matters and give great understanding. That's why I said for some of y'all... For real, stop. For some of y'all, though, as we go to the next card, though, this is a person that tried to humiliate you. And now they're trying to have some state of understanding. Wait, my man, the TV jumped on. Some of y'all dealing with somebody who tried to, I keep telling you, I'm telling you, this shit might be ready. Whoever this person is, this is somebody that tried to humiliate you. What the fuck they said? My phone. This is somebody that tried to humiliate you. They really did. They did. I said that this ain't protection from adversaries, rabies, and wild beasts. I'm telling you, this is being illuminated coming up to the forefront. Some of y'all, this shit gonna be so clear, so plain as day that's coming up to you, though. Yeah, this is a new start. I told you that. I said that this shit gonna be so clear to y'all. I'm telling you, that moon gonna be just like a sun. Let's go to the next part. I'm telling you, that moon gonna be just like a sun. Because I'm telling you, whoever this is that you're trying to get back cool with, I'm telling you, they ain't here what they got going on down below. I remember them cold nights. I was sleeping on the floor. And this don't even have to be something. This could be just please that motherfuckers made with the devil. Some people ain't healed there. That's why I said they have not. I remember on the corner. Uh, we got stranger and curiosity. Let's see what the stranger talking about. 
Stranger. Some of y'all singing, this a stranger in my house, baby. You a stranger. You don't know who you is. I ain't saying it to be mean, though, but there's a chapter where there's like, it's an ending, but it's also a new beginning because some of y'all are starting to look at yourself exactly for who you are. Some of y'all been so foreign from the person who you have become. Then we're going to laugh after this. Some of y'all been so far from the person who it is that you've become that when you look in the mirror, some of y'all don't even feel like you see yourself. And you want to know why? Because one of y'all been trying to jump in my energy and that's how you feel about yourself. You judge yourself really harsh. So I was like, no, man, when I get up, I'm smiling like a toddler. Hi. Hi. We got six of pentacles and we also got the um, three of wands. Some of y'all always in your business, baby. I don't like this. Somebody could just be curious about you, right? Whoever this is. There's somebody that's curious about you, though, and I don't like it, though, because somebody bringing them information. What did you say, me, Lord? I don't like this. <laughs> I don't like this. Like, they coming to them bringing them information. Some of y'all got to have faith, and y'all really don't want to have faith. <laughs> that's why some of y'all lost y'all power with your witchcraft. Stop believing. You believe in the you believe in the magic. You got the page of cups. Some of y'all, this is comfort. This is the inner child. This is rejoicing knowing that particular people that's been trying to wish ill will on you, but they did. Some of y'all, this is stepping into a new season, though, especially with the six of wands. Some of y'all, this is a long stint. I don't know why I feel like every time I see this man seem like he on the football field, when he just runs like that touchdown. Whoever that is, like a Heisman or something. We also got three of pentacles. This is mental force. I saw you this is counseling. This is also understanding. Some of y'all, this is a higher power. I saw you some of y'all could be going to therapy because somebody who's making some truth. They making it vividly. Y'all getting a lot of cards that's saying elimination, vivid, understanding. This is clarity. I'm telling you, like, a lot of y'all getting a lot of clarity on a lot of situations, though, especially when it comes to people, though, as well. Fertilities for some of y'all though as well. Some of y'all been trying to now whoever this is in a couple. Uh, this came up about a uh, same sex couple. Two men they were trying to have a baby and one of them was trying to figure out which one of them was gonna give up their sperm so they can have a baby. But I was like I didn't trust the person they was having a baby with. I told him mm, background check came clear, but I didn't. Mm -mm, I didn't like her. Mm, okay, and they did her. I didn't like her. I did. We got, I didn't trust her. It seemed like it was all about the money. It did. Just go watch the damn reading. I said that. We got King of Cups. We got this, we got the King of Cups as well. And we also have the Temperance. I said that, though, this is regarding the faith with the joy of God, though. Some of y'all going to know that, though, whatever spirit your life will say your life. Because whatever you're going to see somebody else going through. And I told you that somebody just stole something from you. I said that this motherfucker stole something from you. This could have been something. I told you it's time, it's energy, it's an emotion, something. This could have been a promotion. This could be a job, baby. This could be money. Whoever this is, this is a continuation. This is somebody that's been paid to do shit, to keep stealing shit from you. Does you make? Does this make sense? Somebody being paid to keep stealing shit from your ass. Whether they going over there doing magic, whatever the hell. Like, they're being paid. Some of y'all too, there's somebody want your blood. Because, ugh. It's not for a spell work. They want to know what the fuck you got that they ain't got. Okay, we're finna go. Somebody want your blood because they trying to figure out. Not like in a, oh, I want to drink that shit. They want to figure out, like, why the fuck you're not getting sick. So that's why somebody want to know that, though. So somebody trying to poke pride, run run test, right? Right? What's What what, what, what they got? What, what is them? Yes. Yes, because they is. They're trying to find out. They're lying about it, though. They want to know, like, what the hell you got going on that can't make you? Why you're not sick? Why you're not this? There's somebody that's like that, though, for real. They really want to know. Some of y'all didn't know this, for real. Then, too, there could have been that moon magic as well. That person who comes keep paying to steal your shit to do magic on you, though, for real. They say God sees everything. If somebody keep doing that, you seen that light flick? That bitch don't flick. Because I'm telling you, whoever it is, you need to get your spirit, baby. Trying to get them to follow behind me. We go, they go to bed over her. I going to bed. <laughs> what? I'm saying, they be trying to send them damn spirits. I'm like, baby, we going to bed over here. Shit, I don't know who the fuck what you be running over there. But we going to bed. You you had enough time cracking all up my motherfucking walls. Lights out. I'm put the blanket on, baby. You going to bed right here. You ain't cutting up in this bitch.
Shit, but we take naps. And you finna go to bed. You don't pay no bills in this motherfucker. Go steal that money and bring that shit back to me. I might listen to what you got to say. What? That's so black. Let me pull one more card. We're gone. Did it fit? No, none of this clip. That's so black people. Then we get on live. Girl, that's two. <laughs> I see one. Hold up, man. I see one. Calm down, Steve. Calm down. Bam. Like unto God. Yep. <laughs> Makes the true known the legal proceedings. I told you that it's a HIPAA case coming up. I keep telling y'all, this somebody that wants your blood because they want to know. Read this. Hold on, wait a minute. I'm trying to focus it. It says, Lights of Understanding Acquires Knowledge and Cures Illnesses. I told you I was not lying. Then look at this other thing, too. The only God. This says desire for knowledge, protection from liars, evil spells, and bad spirits. It could have been why somebody's trying to buy another sales to you. And you also got two of wands. Somebody who's planning to attack you, they can't. And they say it about it. I told you it's coming through in your dreams. Hello? I like it. Ah, right, so that's it though. You can do a lie. 